If one kid or grown up watches this on YouTube and changes their behavior, exactly. that's intense legacy. It was from 2007 to 2011, I replied to every single email and tweet I got until four in the morning. Nobody knew who I was, so I would go into Twitter search, search wine terms, and jump into conversations that people would tweet having this Pinot Noir, and I would reply, they didn't know me, and I would reply, that's a good one, did you try the year before? And slowly, but surely, for hours and hours and hours, for years and years and years, I built a foundation that years and years and years later started the creation of what people see now. And meanwhile, people start a TikTok account, post five times, don't go viral, and they're like, this sucks. The, the lost art of patience and foundational. And, and this has a lot to do with parenting. Our parents' generation around the world, where they could, when they, they borrowed money from parents. Our parents borrowed money from grandparents and paid them back if they wanted a house or start a business. Now, kids think their parents should just give them money. Yeah. If you're 22 years old or older in the world and your parents are giving you money, you're in deep trouble. Why? Because you have been told by your parents and you've told yourself that you were un- incapable of standing on your own two feet. Correct. Which immediately leads to insecurity. Which leads to very bad behavior. Dependence. The end. And then when I say this, and this is maybe the fifth or sixth time I've said this publicly, I'll get a bunch of emails saying, you don't know me, I have two children from a bad man who left me. I'm like, live in a worse house. I'm, I'm like, why am I looking at your, in- if your situation's so horrible and you need to take your appearance, why did I just click your Instagram account and you have a Prada bag? Yeah. We've become so materialistic that people want all these things, but they want them. The question is why do they want them? They want them because we're communicating to the world. Every one of us right now is wearing what we're wearing, our haircuts, everything, communication. We're positioning ourselves to the world. I I really, really think there's a lot of important conversations that are not being had. I'm trying to throw them out there and I enjoy, I remember, you know, meeting with you like a year ago, like I like when people see what I'm, and, and my hope is that if I have the courage to say stuff that people aren't talking about, then others will start doing it. Like these are important, this is an important video. This, what if one kid or grown up watches this on YouTube and changes their behavior, that's intense legacy.